Superheroes embody everything we define as strength. However, that doesn't mean they don't have some weaknesses of their own. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 superhero weaknesses. Let's point those claws of yours in a safer direction. For this list, we'll be ranking all of the most notable frailties that bring our favorite superpowered beings to their knees. In all the years to come in your most private moments, I want you to remember the one man who beat you. Number 10, Wonder Woman, her own lasso of truth. This is not your truth. Very often in the comic book world, a superhero's most trusted weapon turns out to be their greatest weakness. The lasso of truth, forged from Aphrodite's girdle, forces its victims to succumb to the command of its wielder. How do we shut off these charges? You can't. We'll all be dead shortly. The truth hurts, doesn't it? In spite of Wonder Woman's prowess with the weapon, she has more than once become entangled in her own lasso, rendering her submissive to its own power. <laughs> Add in the fact that the lasso is pretty much indestructible, and the Amazonian warrior might just have a problem. Number 9. Shazam! Saying his own name. Speak the word. Shazam! Have you ever heard of that expression, it isn't what you say, but how you say it? Yeah, well, Shazam might just benefit from taking that word as virtue. Shazam! Shazam! By speaking the mystical word of Shazam, young Billy Batson takes the form of the Herculean superhero. Shazam! As convenient as this may appear, it is by the same token that Billy Batson is converted back to his regular form, which can make things quite awkward when it comes time for introductions, especially since he's not allowed to really call himself Captain Marvel anymore. I'm Captain Marvel, sir, and it is an honor. You're my biggest fan. Excuse me? I, I mean, I'm your biggest fan. Number eight, Cyclops, lack of control over his optic beam. You better close your eyes. That visor isn't just a fashion statement, you know. And his mutation gives him the ability to shoot immensely powerful energy beams from his eyes. However, he was also born without the means to control his power. Scott, when I tell you, open your eyes. No, trust me. You dropped something. No. While commonly seen wearing sunglasses in public, Cyclops outfits himself with a special visor that lets him control different aspects of his optic blast, like intensity and size. Don't move. Without this, the X-Man must shield his eyes, as the exposition of his unrestrained power would almost certainly turn catastrophic. Number 7. Venom. High-pitched frequency. The alien symbiote suit has been witnessed attaching itself to several different hosts and taking on a multitude of different forms. However, its sensitivity to high-pitched sounds remains consistent. War Machine! He reacts to loud noise! I've got just the thing, a concentrated sonic disruptor blast. As Venom, wearing the suit, a host is subject to unmatched strength, speed, and durability. Although, faced with a high-pitched sonic frequency, the suit will become severely weakened as the symbiote writhes in agony. If the sound is potent enough, the symbiote will either leave its host completely or perish, taking its host with it. The noise! What it does! You tricked us! Number 6. Aquaman. Lack of water. Aquaman! While unfairly thought of as a bit of a joke by many comic book fans, this superhero has established himself as one of the most capable members of the Justice League for a variety of reasons. The rightful King of Atlantis is widely formidable on land as well as water, but they don't call the guy Aquaman for nothing. Ah! 
as he's adapted to living at the very depths of the ocean, Aquaman's powers are greatly increased when he's submerged in a body of water, consequently making him grow weaker when he's away from precious H2O for too long. Number 5. Green Lantern – Yellow The almighty power rings assigned to the Green Lantern Corps grant them immense power, although they do come with quite an absurd weakness. The aversion to the color yellow has been a staple in the Green Lantern continuity. However, the origin has been largely reinterpreted over the years. I'm here for the yellow element. You are not the one. What readers now understand this weakness to be is a representation of fear, the counter to the hero's willpower. We needn't highlight the inconvenience that this can bring to the superhero that can materialize virtually anything with his mind, but it's still one of the strangest things we've seen a superhero yield to. Number 4. Iron Man – His Heart You know, I've got a cluster of shrapnel, I'm trying every second to crawl its way into my heart. This stops it. This little circle of light, it's part of me now. This internal injury brought light to the fact that inside the fortified suit of armor, Tony Stark is still just a regular man. <laughs> Due to a traumatic chest injury that lodged shrapnel near his heart, Tony has augmented himself with an arc reactor to keep the vital organ functioning. Oh, it's While the mechanical device did keep him alive, it was shown to require a lot of care and frequent recharging. Is that so hard? That was fine, eh? With time and further upgrades, the battery unit would soon prove to be fully operational and able to power all of his iconic Iron Man suits, but would still remain his core weakness. Number 3. Martian Manhunter – Fire Who would have ever thought that Martians would be vulnerable to fire? Then again, who'd have ever thought they'd encounter a Martian? I've read the minds of his entire group. None of them knows the origin of the device. The true story behind this less than obvious weakness has been both shrouded in mystery and littered with inconsistency. While some comic book iterations see the superhero melt into a pool of green plasma when in contact with fire, others define the weakness as a hindrance to his telepathy powers. Whatever the case, it has become evident throughout the years that the Martian Manhunter has never been a fan of flames. <laughs> Number 2. Spider-Man – Friends and Family So I want you to promise me something, okay? Leave Gwen out of it. They don't call him your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man for nothing. As obvious as this one may not appear to be, many forget that Spider-Man is one of the few superheroes that lives a completely normal and mundane life outside of his vigilanteism. This puts the ones he cares for the most at risk, making his secret identity that much more precious. I promised him that I would keep away from you. Because of this, villains are always trying to figure out who is the face under the mask, and use those he loves as pawns against him. You don't get me fault. You take it away. No, Harry. I'm gonna take away yours. No, run, run! No, Harry! Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Number 1. Superman – Kryptonite What is that? I think you know exactly what this is. Taking the top spot is the elusive green rock that turns the Man of Steel into Silly Putty. I told you. That's Kryptonite, Superman. A little souvenir for the old hometown. Something that should be hard to find seems readily accessible to Superman's adversaries. And Batman himself even created an artificial but highly effective version of the stuff for himself. Now! While it has now become a cheap device to balance an already massively overpowered superhero, it has also set the trend for all major comic book weaknesses to follow. Do you agree with our list? 
Aquaman! Wait! Why do you follow? What superhero weakness did we miss? <laughs> For more awesome top tens published every day, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com. Shizra! <clears throat> Fight's over, son. Thank you.